and welcome to my very first video. Um, I am going to be doing a Stitch Fix unboxing and try on. I have been watching a ton of different unboxing videos and decided that I thought it would be fun to try it myself. Um, this is my third box actually, uh, but the first one I'm making a video on. Um, if you don't know what Stitch Fix is, it's basically a subscription service to receive uh, five pieces of clothing or jewelry, um, or you know, occasionally they'll have jewelry in there. Um, they it's twenty bucks a month or twenty bucks per box, but they will credit that towards any purchases that you have. Um, you can do it. Um, I think every three months or once a month or even more frequently than that or you can even schedule it just say I want a random fix as you so choose um, maybe for a special event or something like that um, so let's go ahead and get into it um, I'm very excited about this um, it's a little heavy so I think uh, there might be some sort of shoe in here. Um, I asked for the, th the things I was kind of interested in was um, some dress pants for work. And I know that I'm uh, also interested in getting a pair of booties because I actually don't have any. So since it's heavy, I'm thinking maybe I got them. So we shall see. Um, so cut it open, but haven't taken a peek yet. So, okay. We'll start with what's on top, and here's my bundle. Um, I see some prints and some dark colors, um, so let's dive into it. First off, we have this pattern blouse here. Um, it's got like a leaf pattern, it's see-through, um, and uh, it is maroon colored, three quarter length sleeve. Um, it's cute. I'm not as into the see through. I mean, I know obviously you wear something underneath it, but um, I tend to get cold in the office in these. Um, but we'll see. Um, and here's oh, a short sleeve shirt with um, kind of a diamond print here um, again kind of a see-through here um, but this you know would be a good work shirt um, potentially um, okay next up um, we have oh feels big so I think this might be a dress of some sort Oh, it's a cardigan. Okay, it's just a it's just a nice thick material. Um, oh, I think I asked or on my Pinterest board. I have some drape front blazers and cardigans, and so that's what that looks like. Drape front, um, navy blue with you know some white stitching in there. Um, seems to be very good quality. Um, I like that. I like that so far. Um, next up, I think these would be my dress pants that I am interested in. Um, they are I'm trying to figure out if they're dark brown or they're black. Um, I actually can't really tell because um, they've got a black tag on it, but um, I think these are dark brown. Um, so they're obviously skinny, um, stretchy, like a very stretchy, um, uh, material. Seem like they'd be very comfortable. Um, and last, uh, we will get to the shoes. Um, Yes, these feel like a booty, so I am very excited to try these. Okay. Oh, 
These are almost exactly like a pair that I had pinned on Pinterest. So I think these are very cute. Uh, you know, can't wait to pair these with a pair of skinny jeans. Um, so yes, um, very cute. Um, so we will try all this on now. So hopefully, hopefully this stuff works out. The first outfit here is the, this is the Ellie three quarter sleeve blouse. And this is the uh, Liverpool uh, Jacqueline skinny pant. Um, first impressions, I actually like the blouse on a little better than I expected. Um, I like the color, the pattern isn't too flashy and you know, it's a nice blouse that looks nice um, tucked in the front to a pair of pants. Um, the pants, um, I was looking for a dressy pant I could wear to work and these are tight, like tight, tight. Well, and they're, they're leggings. So um, my work environment doesn't really, isn't really conducive to leggings. So I just have to think about, you know, are there other places I would be wearing these to? Um, and, you know, I'm not sure. I'm not a huge legging person. So, um, I don't know. We'll have to, we'll have to see about that. Um, the shirt is a little bit longer in the back. Um, this is what it looks like uh, untucked. So here's the 360. Okay, this is the Giraldi split neck blouse. Um, and I'm not a huge fan of it. Um, could go under a cardigan or a blazer. Um, again, um, you know, the style is kind of the looser blouses and I do like that. Um, if I tuck it in a little bit here, um, you can see it. Um, so here's the 360. Um, I'm just gonna give it, it's an okay. I just don't really care for the print that much. This is, this is the Mullins drape front cardigan. Um, it's a good thick material. Um, the sleeves actually have a thumb hole in them. Um, you know, might be nice for working in the cold at work. I mean, I work inside. I'm just cold all the time. Um, and the cardigan's nice. Um, the sleeves are a bit long um, for me. Um, but I do like the cardigan. Um, and uh, I like the drape front aspect of it. Um, it's cute. Um, so we'll have to see. Um, these might be something that I consider if the price is right. Um, and next I will show you guys the booties. Um, the booties are very cute. Love these a lot. Um, love to pair these with some skinny jeans. Doesn't really go with these brown pants, but, um, yeah, I think they're very cute. Now that I've tried on the clothes, um, I'm ready to read through my stylist note and look at the prices. I like to not look at the prices until the end because I want to view the clothes unbiased um, to see what I really think of them before I even worry about what the cost is. Um, so from the letter from my stylist, um, last time I had Tara, um, loved my last stitch fix. It was almost a five out of five. Um, so I was hoping to get her again, which I did. Um, her notes reads, Hi Jennifer, happy fix day. I was delighted to style you again for fix number three. Today's fix is filled with some great options for you to incorporate into your work wardrobe, which I said that was kind of my top priority. I've been wearing the same dress clothes for a decade at this point. Um, I was able to snag you a cute pair of booties, the MIA Collins suede booty in taupe. That is a great neutral that can easily be matched with any color. Agreed. I have included the Alice Blue split neck blouse that will look great under a 
blazer or cardigan for a nice pair of dress pants. I've included the brown Liverpool skinny pant pair with the burgundy 3-4 sleeve blouse from Mixed by 41 Hawthorne for an instant outfit. I hope you have fun trying on all your pieces. I can't hear to see what you think. Any special requests for your next fix, let me know, Tara. Okay. Um, and then now uh, the scary part is the prices. Um, okay, so the pants are Liverpool, that's, they're the Jacqueline Skinny Pant, and they are $78. Um, these are the Collins Suede Booty uh, by MIA. And those, these are $99. Ooh. So the Giraldi Split Neck Blouse, um, that is by Ellis Blue, and this is $44. And then um, the, then the, um, the Ellie printed three-fourths quarter sleeve, which is what I'm still wearing. This is by Mix by 41 Hawthorne. Um, this is $48. And then the last piece, um, this is the drape front cardigan, the Mullins drape front cardigan by Articles of Society. And they, this is $48. Um, so the total for the entire box is $317. Um, if you buy all five, you get a 25% discount, um, which would take off $79.25. Um, and then if you subtract that and the purchasing or the styling fee, that's an extra $20 off. Well, you already paid it ahead of time, the $20. The order total would be $217.75. Um, this is by far the most expensive box that I've gotten out of the three. Um, I asked for some of these things, the booties, um, the dress pants, even um, for something to wear under a blazer, um, I asked for, um, but it, it all came out more expensive um, than I was hoping for. Um, so I'm going to think about it overnight and think about what to keep. Um, the pants are definitely too expensive. Um, the booties are too expensive. The only thing I'm considering is the drape front cardigan or this blouse here. Um, I'm going to have to sleep on it tonight and figure out what I want to keep. So I will check in with you guys and let you know. Okay, after thinking about it overnight and I tried on a few of the tops in a couple of different outfits that I usually wear to work. Um, please pardon the lack of uh, stylish other pieces. Um, I decided not to keep anything. I uh, hate giving up my $20 stylish fee, styling fee. But, um, it, you know, you, even when you subtract off $20 you already paid, I'm paying $25, 30 extra for shirts that I'm kind of like, yeah, I like, um, but not some stuff I usually buy, nothing that I can't not be without. Um, I, last stitch fix, I had a pair of shoes that I wasn't planning to keep, and when I slept on it overnight, it was like th that shoes was all I could think about. And so there was nothing here that I felt like I couldn't part with. So um, I'm going to have to send it all back. Uh, I think this Stitch Fix was just, it was out of my price range, a lot of this stuff. Um, so, you know, I'm going to have to give that feedback. I, I loved the booties. Um, I liked the maroon top. Um, there was there was a few pieces here I really didn't like, but it was just too expensive. So that's the end of my Stitch Fix video. Um, if you like it, uh, please subscribe. I did put a link to my Stitch Fix referral down below, so if you're interested in trying it, um, feel free to click on that link. Um, and thanks for coming. I've got a couple other videos I'm planning on doing. Um, just I've been trying out a few different 
um, subscription type boxes. Um, I've got a e salon, which is a hair color, and functional beauty, which is a custom shampoo. So um, subscribe and uh, check it out. Um, and we'll see you guys later. Thanks. Bye.